it's Michelle, Truth and Integrity Warrior. I wanted to do a video on the vinegar lemonade that I make with cinnamon. The cinnamon cuts the vinegar smell and vinegar taste, but I get the good benefits of vinegar in the body without it being harsh to my system. And I want to just go over how I make that. I already have one pre-made because I just did a video in Spanish and I showed how I make, you know, my, my vinegar cinnamon lemonade. I'm just going to call it a detox lemonade uh, for short. So this detox lemonade is just a basic lemonade. You have your water and your lemon and your sweetener. And what I use is uh, something called pure stevia, which is not the same as the stevia in the little package that gets cut with uh, neurotoxins, uh, other sweeteners. I'll put a list of what sweeteners to stay away from that are artificial and cause problems in neurology, behavior, uh, feeling, emotion, and how to find pure stevia uh, for keeping, uh, for people who don't want to have any uh, sugar in their diet or less sugar in their diet. But you can actually use any any type of, anything to sweeten that you would like with this lemonade. You can use a maple syrup, you can use honey, you can use whatever it is that is your preference for your uh, for your lemonade. So you wanna get your lemonade with, I, I have a recipe right here. You can double it up and do however you'd like. This is two liters of water with two lemons. Cut two lemons, squeeze them in there, good to go. And then what I do is a fourth of stevia, pure stevia. I get that little measuring spoon, do a fourth. Then I do a fourth of powdered cinnamon. I don't buy the loose stuff when it comes to cinnamon or and any loose anything because I don't know if they cut it with um, with other substances. I've already come into that experience from stores that I trust and I just can't trust any loose uh, ingredients. I like it. I like to be able to read what's in the back, know exactly what's in, what's coming inside of uh, my products. So I recommend getting a product that's just, it's pure product, like powdered cinnamon, ground cinnamon. And so the cinnamon has a bunch of properties you can look up, incredible for the body, stimulator, energizer, it has a bunch of benefits, but my focus right here is what is the, this lemonade with the vinegar. How do we get vinegar into our diet? Uh, getting vinegar into the diet is really hard for a lot of people because they don't like fermented foods. That's one way to get uh, vinegar into our diet. But I think kids love this lemonade. Like literally will give me their their uh, soda money for this lemonade. I've already had that experience and they want more and they go find more money so they can buy more lemonade. I say buy more lemonade because I've been at a, a, a kid's fair at my, my kid's school and none of the parents thought the kids would drink this. I sold out. I sold out. This, this stuff, what it does is it makes, it quenches your thirst at the same time. You want more. Your body feels energized. You feel more lively. And you just feel better. And the reason why is because we're getting something in our body that we're not used to having, but the body loves it. And it reacts really well to it. So besides being um, an energizer, vinegar helps to energize. It cleans out. Uh, helps to clean out the body, gets the trash out the body, which are which we call toxins. It regulates all the pHs in the body. You want a good pH? You take some vinegar inside of some water, drink that, and you got a pH regulator. Gives the proper pH for the stomach, proper pH for the blood, the saliva, the urine. Everybody gets regulated just with a little cup of this lemonade. That's 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 a wonderful thing. So we might not be able to get sauerkraut always in our diet and, and looking for some kimchi, which is a which is another type of cabbage that's fermented. So these fermented foods have uh, vinegar in them. But if we're talking about trying to get it into our regular diet, something refreshing on a hot summer day, we're talking about this um, detox lemonade. And so I'm gonna go by real quick and say how I made it. Again, two liters of water, Two lemons, one fourth of a teaspoon of ground cinnamon, and a fourth of a teaspoon of stevia. Again, you can modify and make changes, but what we want to get in those two liters of water is one tablespoon, which is not a teaspoon, but a tablespoon, one of the bigger spoons of vinegar. And this is just regular white vinegar. You can use any vinegar you want, but it will change the flavor. And I like to keep the flavor like a lemonade, so I use the white vinegar. Kids are sharp. 
they, they don't like you messing around and giving them, sneaking them something, something strange in their food. And if I can get this white vinegar into their lemonade, and the, because what happens is the cinnamon neutralizes this flavor. So apart from getting the benefit from uh, all the benefits from cinnamon, you're also cutting the vinegar taste. So it makes it uh, makes it a uh, little great disguise, and kids love it. So you can put one tablespoon in the two liters of water, which tastes great. It has a nice little balanced flavor. Or when you start liking it more and you want a little more strength, a little more of that kombucha kind of like uh, strong, strong flavor, you can just add another uh, tablespoon. But as far as I know, kids and fussy adults like one, one tablespoon in two liters of water. I'll be posting the recipe uh, and you can, like I said, use it as a guide to kind of get an idea and you can modify it to your taste and to your like. It's just the fact of getting a tablespoon in the uh, vinegar white vinegar into two liters of water and making a beverage for this hot summer to be able to quench your thirst, energize the body and the energy, and at the same time, help your body detox. And by the way, it also is a natural deodorizer. So you end up not even needing to use, um, what is it, deodorants. And so I have used deodorant over 15 years because this is just part of you know, my lifestyle. I might not have one every day, but when I make it, I make it. And I know what I'm doing when I'm um, drinking it. So if something does get a little funky, I'll be like, oop, I'm, I'm slacking on my on my uh, detox lemonade. And I'll get back on it. But pretty much that, that doesn't happen because it's just part of my lifestyle. Um, in other videos you see where I just do water, vinegar, in, a, in the refrigerator. And I take two swigs in the morning. And that's how... That's how I maintain my pH on a regular basis. So if I'm not making the lemonade because it's winter time, you know, I don't want it's too cold. I just have my 16 ounces of water, my teaspoon or two of, uh, and I said teaspoon, not tablespoon, teaspoon or two in my 16 ounce water in the fridge. I just take two swigs in the morning, pH regulator, good to go, energizer. And it keeps all of the body odors, even breath, bad breath, people have a hard time with bad breath. It's wonderful uh, body, natural body deodorizer. Uh, that smells just in general. They start cleaning up because vinegar is, like we're saying, is antiviral, antifungal. I don't even know if I, this is my second video. I did what is Spanish, so I don't even know if I told you guys in English, but it's vinegar is antiviral, antifungal, anti-mold, anti-yeast. It's antimicrobial. It's amazing, but we don't have it in our diet. And so making uh, detox lemonades like this and making it where kids would be like, where's my lemonade? You said you were going to make me my lemonade. My niece just told me that yesterday. She was like, you said you were going to make the lemonade. And they love this stuff. So to, uh, to cut this short, just uh, make a detox lemonade. See how you feel. See if it perks up and peps you up. See if um, the body odors start coming down. And I will guarantee you, uh, the body starts just getting better because it needs tools like this in its regular to be put into our body on a regular basis as a lifestyle we live in a toxic world uh, nowadays and we're getting bombarded by all kinds of different toxins in the environment in our food in our products and so tools like the citrus lemon the cinnamon the vinegar just putting those things in our body make all the difference in the world so look up these different different things that I was talking about what I'm making right here and you'll see the benefit that they got. Alright. Truth Integrity Warrior, Michelle Angelique, peace out.